Hi everyone, Basil Chapman for the 11 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. Dow's down 25, it was down uh, over 140 just earlier on. Uh, 35,728, <coughs> can't keep a good market down, I guess. And what we are looking at is if there is a new a recovery high above yesterday's high of uh, 30, 30, uh, 5,840 uh, in the next, uh, between today and Friday, that is going to suggest, and that would include tomorrow with the inflation numbers coming out early in the morning, um, that would suggest that the market is kind of looking ahead and, and so far it's acting very positively. Let's see what happens. Key support will be at the 35,500 level. We are looking at uh, 35,500 to 400 in the Dow. S&P at this particular point is a little bit weaker than the Dow, but it's still acting quite nicely. It's down 16 and 46.85. Had a really good comeback uh, all the way in the last three sessions. And so today's a bit of a day of rest. Let's see if it's able to get to the 47.10 area by Friday or Monday, uh, better than uh, sliding below 46.62. Uh, what we're looking at is the QQQ, the NDX 100, struggling a little bit more. It's down 215, a 397.46. Uh, it needs to get to the 405 area between, uh, well, by Tuesday, by Monday to Tuesday at the uh, at the latest and if it, if it pulls back to the 393 is the key support IWM is lagging IWM is down 2.46 at 223 it's lagging the different indices gold has been very weak gold is and uh, come back a little bit it's only down four but it just hasn't shown any leadership the dollar is acting okay it's near its all time it's recovery high it's at 96.26 but what's really interesting I didn't have a chance in the show because I had so many questions come up in my Tiger Tradition show a moment ago, uh, the TLT is up $1.33 at $149.72. It's had quite a bit of a pullback from that back into the rectangle formation um, since the high of made about five days ago at 152 almost 153 Going to watch this closely for interest rates to see what happens after tomorrow's news report, the economic report, and crude oil. Coming back a bit off a little bit of weakness earlier on, it's down 59 cents at 71.77. Had a good couple of sessions, and we'll see what happens there. Crude oil needs to get to the 73s to show that it's, it's, it's garnered uh, strength again. So stay tuned. You've got Larry Presidente coming up, Think or Swim. Then you've got uh, Steve Rhodes, Dave White, Tom O'Brien. Have a great day. Check out my opening call, my daily newsletter. Have a wonderful day. Stay tuned to TFNN.